welcome to another video. In today's video, we're analyzing this whole divine intervention theory. So first and foremost, I'm with Bill Maher on this. I do believe millions of no, Americans No, that's believe just luck. God's hand is on I mean, that's the difference between how we see it. But, okay. No, we just see that differently. Some people see, you know, there's this order and everything, and some people see randomness. Right. What about the guy behind him who got shot? Because, I mean, I know, but like you say, God, I mean, what, God's not f happy with that guy? Okay, so, I'm not a religious scholar, but I, I have the basics down. So, there's the good guys, and there's the bad guys, right? And the good guys are up in the clouds, and the bad guys are down with the lava. Okay. So, it's the good guys versus the bad guys, absolute evil versus absolute good. That's the mindset, okay? I don't participate in this mindset because there is no such thing as absolute good and absolute evil in nature. You know, a hurricane goes, rips stuff up, and new stuff can come and grow, right? Predominantly before humans populated the areas and people die and all that, but you know. So, but we're sticking with this theory of absolute good and absolute evil, because that's where this divine intervention theory is coming from, okay? So, there's an alternative theory to that same kind of level of thesis, right? So, let's take for example that it's the absolute evil that perpetrated that whole entire situation. Because they know the evil that a second Trump presidency is going to bring to the world that the evil put the guy on the roof. The evil made the cops doop de doo The evil turned his head at the right moment. That's a lot more fathomable than, than like Bill Maher says. Okay? I mean, there was a whole procedure of, of missteps and miscalculations, and it all led up to like the most perfect, you know? That's evil. Or it's a, it's a random fluke. Now, personally, I don't believe in the whole absolute good, absolute evil, and demons and all that shit, or having some battles on the earth and all. I don't really subscribe to that notion. But, I have this unique ability where I can actually put my mind into the minds of people that think like that and think through the thought process, okay? And when you look at it from an intellectual point of view, like how could it have possibly been divine? If it was divine, the guy never would have even shot anybody. People died. It makes a lot more sense that it was the, the absolute evil was at work. And it's the absolute evil that is on the side of Trump. Like, subscribe, and peace.